Welcome back to AI Master. Rocket in today's video, I'll show you the new task update on Aligner and quickly walk you through how to complete it step by step. I will show you the mail that comes from Aligner team and then move to actual project. Let's open Chrome to show you my mail that comes from project coordinator. So, the first step I did was open my email and simply search for Aligner in the search bar. And there it was, a mail from the Aligner community about a brand new project. Inside the mail, they provide two important links. One is the guide, which explains how to do the task step by step, and the other is the task labeling link, where you actually perform the work. I also got another important mail from Aligner, a Hubstaff invitation. Hubstaff is used to track the hours you work, and that's how Aligner calculates your payment. So every hour you spend on tasks is recorded, and you get paid for your time. Now it's time to go to the project and see exactly how the new task works. So, here we are inside the Aligner dashboard. As you can see, I've already completed my Zara interview, which means I now have access to tasks. And along with that, a few new assessments are also available that match my skills. Now let's head over to the project section. All the tasks are available in label box, just like I explained in my previous video. Logging in is simple. Just use the same email that's linked with your Aligner account. Once you're inside label box, you'll notice there are currently two active projects. The first one is the Aligner Community Hindi task, where you need to label Hindi responses. And the second one is the voice task, where you'll be labeling conversations between the assistant and the user. Now let me show you one of my completed tasks. In the data row section, you can see the exact time I spent on labeling for this project. This helps you track how long each task takes. On the left-hand side, there's the efficiency corner, which highlights your performance stats. For me, the average time per task is around 22 minutes, which shows how efficiently I was able to complete the assignment. Now move to a fresh new task and I show you how to complete this task. To begin, simply click on the start button to open your labeling task. In this case, it's a voice labeling task where you'll be working with conversations between the user and the agent. Your job is to carefully listen to the audio and then label the conversation according to the instructions provided. Each response in the dialogue has a timestamp, so you'll need to mark your labels at the correct points in time. It's important to stay focused, listen closely, mark the conversation accurately, and match the labels with the timestamps. That's all it takes to successfully complete this kind of task on a liner. When you start working on this task, the first thing you should do is slow down the audio speed. This makes it easier to clearly understand what's being said. For example, in this conversation, the word figure appears, I've already labeled it, and it shows up right at the five second mark. Later in the same audio, the word hi is spoken, and that should be labeled at around the 12 second mark. So the key is simple. Listen carefully, match the words with the right timestamps, and then apply the correct labels. In this audio, I'll show you how to mark the agent's voice. Around the 7 second mark, you'll notice the agent starts speaking. Your job is to carefully listen and follow the conversation. While listening, pay attention to the moments when the agent actually pauses. These pauses are very important to label correctly. In the assistance token section, you'll find the option for marking a pause. Simply select it and then mark it as standard. This way, every time the agent pauses in the conversation, you record it properly. Accurate labeling like this ensures the dataset is clean and makes your work more valuable on a liner. To work more efficiently, I recommend setting the timeline resolution to 1. This makes labeling faster and more accurate. But when you want to review all your work, just increase the resolution and you'll clearly see every label. For example, on my screen, the user says, I and asks a question, the assistant replies, and then the user speaks again. All of this is neatly labeled with proper timestamps. And that's how you can keep your labeling clean, accurate, and efficient, which not only improves your ratings but also helps you unlock more projects on a liner. I've given my best to explain everything clearly for you. So please like and subscribe, guys, it really motivates me. I don't have a big team like other YouTubers, it's just me working alone. But I always try to bring you honest, clear, and transparent videos to help you out. See you soon in the next video.